Hey everyone, Unlink here, and welcome back to the finale of Okami. Last time we entered the Ark of Yamato and defeated reincarnations of the many enemies and foes we have made throughout our journey. Orochi, the Spider Queen, Crimson Helm, Ninetales, and somewhere around here is Blight. There's Blight. Today, it is time to finally face the ruler of darkness, the source of all the evil in Nippon, Kamui, and the Celestial Plain. Let's do it. Okami Amaterasu, just being able to see you with my own eyes. I can't tell you how much joy it brings me. It pains me that I can't remain with you until the end. But I know that you won't let us down. Now I must join the others, but I'll never forget you, and how we used to play in the fields in our homeland. I pray that you will always shine bright, Amaterasu. And the last Celestial has passed on. Let's do this. There you are, Amaterasu. I thought I could handle this before you arrived, but it seems I have met my match. <laughs> this brings back memories, Mashari. Remember when we faced Orochi but together on the celestial plane? Behold, it is shrouded in darkness, but make no mistake, this is none other than Yami the evil ruler of darkness. It was he who slew the Celestials on board this very Ark, and brought misfortune upon the land of mortals. Of course, it's too dark to see his true form now. And so it begins. The dreaded day of darkness is upon us. Distorted time and space brings about this phenomenon. This ill-fated day only occurs once every 100 years. Nobody, not even the gods, has the power to stop it. I shall, I shall stand firm and fight this battle. For it was I who brought the Ark of Yamato to the Celestial Plane. But I was oblivious to the evil that lurked in its depths. I caused the death of countless innocent Celestials. And brought a curse upon the land of mortals. However, I cannot reset my actions nor undo the past.
Amaterasu. Orochi can only be defeated with the power of the Chosen One. That's what I told you. And you waited for me without question. You waited patiently in this land of mortals. You waited for the day that Nagi, the Chosen One, was born. You believed in me despite knowing that I count myself among the ranks of the accursed Moon Tribe who had escaped from the Lunar Realm. I was deeply moved by your earnest spirit. That is why my faith in you has not waned since that fateful day when we engaged Orochi in battle side by side. Amaterasu, you must return to the Celestial Plane. You must do so in order to bring peace to this world. We have nothing. Not Waka, not Isun, not a single scrap of godly power. And we must fight the ultimate evil. I don't know if we can do this, but we have to try. For the land of mortals, for the deceased lunar tribe, for the celestials murdered by Orochi. And Rejuvenation is restored to us! By hitting Yami enough times, we can stun him and cause him to give up some of our powers that he has stolen. And with Rejuvenation, we have at least enough godly power to use Solar Flare once again. Let's do this. Yami, you'll pay for your crimes against the mortals, against the Celestials, against the Moon Tribe, against everyone. Your darkness will not stand, and neither shall I, apparently. Definitely make use of Rejuvenation to restore any part of the battlefield that Yami destroys, otherwise that will happen. Ain't that just lovely? All right, it's probably a good idea for us to get a Steel Fist and probably a Godly Charm going. And a Vengeance Slip wouldn't be a bad idea either to give us just a little bit of protection. Our second power has returned to us, Power Slash. And with Power Slash, we can slice open the ball containing ya- Oh! Or not! Well, regardless, that did a significant amount of damage to Yami. So progress is being made. When he's stunned, use that power slash. Do not let the opportunity go to waste. And we've retrieved Green Sprout. Now, with Green Sprout, we can bloom and open up the ball containing Yami. That evil fish within? can finally be attacked directly. And we move on to phase two. Sadly, I do not have Gale Storm or Water Spout to get rid of this fire. It would be very appreciated if I did, but I don't have it. Power Slash ain't gonna help. Here we go! What was that? Yami, get out here! Oh crap! Okay, well at least I did something to him.
Our next power, Cherry Bomb. Oh, that will absolutely be useful. Here, come up to my chair. Oh, well, okay. Sure. Get your fire going again. See how... <laughs> God damn it. If I could just stun you, we could get a we could get our cherry bomb going. Oh, are you making a path for me? Well, that's highly appreciated. That's very kind of you. Oh crap. Come on. Get that cherry bomb on the platform, please. Okay, apparently we're just missing. Oh crap, get me out of here. And our next ability, Water Spout, has returned. We can finally deal with that fire. None of that. Okay, looks like the bloom is not going to work. We get Crescent. Nice. Crap. Not sure how Crescent's going to help us in particular, but I won't say no to more godly powers. Okay, please let this land on the... Okay. Improvement, at least. You know what? You suck, Cherry Bomb. I don't know why you're giving me this much grief. Here. Here's where we can make good use of Cherry Bomb. Surely. There we go. Finally got one to go off. All right, come on, let me get the fish. Ah, dang it. I got hung up in the air too long, my bad. Oh, hi. No, 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 we're not, no. We're not doing that. You calm down. God, that is one flexible ball. Come on, here we go. And that ends phase two. Our constellations are slowly being restored to the sky as we fight. And we enter a slot machine? Please don't ice me. I don't want to be put on ice. Veil and Mist would be really handy here, I'm sure. But all we can do for now is slash and hope we get lo ah monsters. <sighs> Hang on, that might actually be helpful. Yeah, let's do some damage. Oh no! Hate that. All right, we at least got a little bit of damage out of this. Okay, you get back here. Progress is progress. Can't say no to that. All right. That is what we want to get because that releases Yami. Or rather it releases a power. Even better. My mistake. I will gladly take Gale Storm. Mm. Yeah, that's helpful with all the fire flying around. I won't say no to a Gale Storm. Could have used it in the last phase, but. 
Okay, give me another power. Dang it. Well, we got health. We got ice. And I don't think that'll actually... Ah! When it's just one of those, that's when it releases Yami. Giving us a chance to attack. Alright, slot machine, let's do this. I'll take another power. And we get Inferno. Don't mind if I do. Get rid of all that ice. And let's go. Another slot machine, please? What are you gonna give me? Fire. Shoot. I can use Gale Storm for that. Ice. Gets the Inferno. And monsters we can deflect to do a little bit of damage. Ah, crap. Now is not the time to be running out of ink. Give me an Infinity Stone. That's two. There's a new power. What are you giving us? We got Veil of Mist. That's what I was looking for. All right, let's do a Veil of Mist. Stop the left. Stop the middle. And give me a new power. Ah, he's out of powers to give for this phase, so let's just finish him off. And on to the next phase. Oh, oh, he's got legs. Oh, oh, he's got arms. Uh-oh. Oh, this is one very flexible ball. Jeez. Hey, look, there's Yami. No, come on. Open back up. Open back up. I want to say hi. I want to say hi to your pretty little fish. Fa oh, dear God. Come on. Play nice. You're only gonna let me do one hit at a time, huh? There we go, stunned him finally. Next up, we get Catwalk. Now is our opportunity. There, ha there are, as you may have noticed, a few statues around the arena with treasures on top that we can get with Catwalk. This is your chance. Do not forget to grab these. Steel Soul Sake, definitely not unwelcome. Ow. I keep forgetting I can't dash when I'm in combat. Are those clay soldiers? <laughs> At the very least, they're made of clay, just like the clay soldiers. Okay. Give me a catwalk. Let's get up there. This one gives us a golden peach. Very handy if you've been struggling. I think we're fine, though. And our last tower, if we don't get murdered, 
gives us a vengeance slip. Three very useful items. All defensive, I want to... Yeah. Oh. Vengeance slip, golden peach, and steel soul socket. Yeah, all defensive items. So definitely helpful for helping, uh, making sure you survive this fight. All right, that's two slashes. One more should knock him down. No! You jerk! I had my celestial brush open. You piece of shit. For that, I'm gonna exercise you. Oh, apparently that he did not like that. Here we go. Next power restored is... Thunderstorm. Oh, oh, you, you are, you are in for it now, Fred. Don't think I haven't been paying attention to your attacks. Hang on. Give me a... Give me a... Where's some lightning? Here's some lightning. Don't think I haven't been paying attention. Oh, I saw what you were doing. All right, yummy. Oh, fine. Waste my steel... Uh, steel fist. But at least I got a new power out of it. We got Blizzard. And that, with the exception of Sunrise, should be everything. Oh, are you not closing up? Oh, are you stuck open? Oh, don't mind if I do take advantage of this situation. Okay, give me some lightning. Here we go. Zap him! Eat shit, Yami! And that's it. Not bad, Furball. Well, you know the drill. Let's have one of those famous howls of yours. Bah, that furball's always spacing out like that. Ami can't get anything done without my help. Is that doggy crying somewhere, sis? Is that why the sunshine has disappeared? I haven't seen the doggy for a while now. Did my saying there's no such thing as gods cause all this? Snowy, the hole digging king. I never dreamt that you were a god. You're gonna make Hayabusa a nervous wreck if you don't get that sun shining again soon. Amaterasu, thanks to you, we can protect our village by ourselves. 
but you must be strong and triumph over evil. For the canine warriors so dearly wish to see you once more. Hmm, that god sure was burning with passion. I don't know what happened, but if that mongrel doesn't come out of hiding, I'll have to send up a really big one to reignite that passion. Oh, so that wolf really was really a god. Perhaps I should have made an offering of my bamboo ware. It may be my fault that the sun has ceased to shine. Who would have ever thought that that rascal was really sure a newy reborn? My, my, how that god loved my cherry cakes. Could this darkness be caused by hunger? Uh-oh. The boss is praying. Snowy, did something happen to you? Why has the sun suddenly disappeared? Fido won't roll over and play dead for evil. No brother of mine would dream of it. Ha ha ha. Something in your brushwork touches the heart, soon. You never abandoned your life as an artist after all. When one tries to master something, it ends in either success or failure. But it is in the attempt itself where you find the true value. Believe in your own power and walk your own path. Isun, I see you have finally heeded your calling. Your resolve is plain to see in your drawing. It has the power to move people's hearts and inspire their faith in the gods. Amaterasu, their faith shall be your power. <laughs> he did it! My grandson did it! Look at the spirit behind this beautiful brushwork. He truly deserves the title of Celestial Envoy. It's work like this that can show the true glory of the gods and guide people to the right path. There's one thing I'm sure of, Amaterasu. You found a much better companion than I could ever be. Okay, everyone. I know it's kind of hard to see in this darkness, but get a load of my latest work. Isun the Wandering Artist presents his interpretation of the great god Amaterasu. Can you hear me, Ami? You're not floundering about without me, are you? You gotta pull yourself together. I finally chose my path, and I have the resolve to see it through. I've started to roam the land as your missionary. But you gotta take care of things on your end, too. Don't look so sad. Just psych yourself up like we always did, remember? Oops, I almost forgot. Check these out, everyone. It's the great god Amaterasu descending from the heavens. Pretty good, huh? Ami was smiling down from the sky just a little while ago. Something must have disturbed the furball's concentration, though. That's why the world has gone dark. Without Ami, we can't take a refreshing nap outdoors. Rice won't grow. Plants and flowers will wither. Laundry won't dry. Monsters will roam about like they own the place. In other words, our world will be a total mess. No one wants to live in a world like that. Especially me. So come on, everybody. Let's join together to call upon the great god. Let's show Ami that we truly believe. Put your hands together and pray. Let's make our gratitude obvious. I mean, we shouldn't pray only when we want something. We should consider how the gods must feel once in a while. We should even take on some of their burden. If you pray with all your heart, maybe the sun will cheer up and show itself once again. Lighting our world with its heavenly glow. After all, the best thing about the great god Amaterasu is that happy-go-lucky spirit. Right, Ami? Answer if you can hear me, you big furball.
Yami thought he had us. He didn't just take away our powers again. He destroyed them. He killed the gods. But the people's faith in Amaterasu restored them, brought them back to life. And now's our chance. Yami is putting in everything he can to beat us, but we will not let darkness win. Just need to find an opening, and we can do this. Come on, bring out the sun! Oh, no you don't! Get back here, Yami! What the hell do you think you're doing? Oh, don't hide away! That's how you're gonna play it, huh? Gonna hide away whenever I pull out my celestial brush so I can't use my powers on you? Alright, we need to find our next opening somehow. There we go! One good shot in, and down he goes. Oh, you get back here. Stop fleeing from me. It'll take more than that to stop us. And stunned once again. Ow! Damn! Okay, good, good. Good use of your, uh, good use of your, uh, getting stunned to knock me out. I'll admit when you did something right. But unfortunately for you, evil will never triumph. Fantastic, Matarasu. What a long and winding road it's been, eh, Mashari? But at last, our arch nemesis Nyami, the Dark Lord who brought darkness upon the land of mortals, has been annihilated for all eternity. I must say, I was really surprised by your little bouncing friend. You couldn't have done it without him. Ha 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 ha! That tickles! Down, heal! You're going to lick me to death! Well, Amaterasu, time to embark even stormier seas. Making the world a better place is never easy. You must return to the celestial plane and set things in order. Only then can you usher in a new age of peace in the mortal world. Our journey is far from over, Mashari. Now, full speed ahead. First up, the Celestial Plane.
the path to heaven, eh? <laughs> kind of sounds like fun. You remember what I said the first time I met you, Ami? There's no stopping me once I've made a decision. So I'm going, Furball. And there's no way you're gonna stop me. I'm gonna pull out all the stops and inspire people's faith in you. You're gonna have more believers than you know what to do with. You'll see. Until then, take care of yourself, you big furball.
And that concludes this most secret of tales. Well, I'd say that's enough storytelling for today. This story contains the hopes and dreams of many fine people. Keep it close to your heart and cherish it. What's that? You want to know why I alone know this tale that no one knows? You listened to the whole story and never figured it out? You missed the whole point! Jeez, what's wrong with you? I suppose I'll have to tell the whole story all over again. You'd best learn to show my brush the respect it deserves. Anyway, I'm tired. Let's call it a day. If you're eager to hear more, I can tell you the rest of the story some other time. Until then, do your best to live up to the heroes I told you about. It's time to roll this scroll up and give it a title. Okami Amaterasu's Adventure. Come back again, okay? Until next time. And so ends Okami. Stick around. After the credits, there will be a result screen. But other than that, I will see everyone next time for the bonus episode. And then a retrospective after that where I'll talk about my thoughts on the game and on how the Let's Play went. I'll stick around for the results and then I will see you next time. It took 45 hours, 69 days, and we made 50 saves. Incredible. Zero deaths, 787 enemies, over almost 10 million yen, 762 demon fags, and we actually missed 50 preys. We'll be getting that in the bonus episode, but gosh, 69 days passed. That's, that's just wonderful. I love that. I'm very happy. I couldn't I could not have possibly planned 69 days. That's so perfect. But yeah. They gave us a nice little result screen at the end of our journey to see how we did. Um unfortunately I did miss 50 praise. I know exactly where it's at. Uh we will go and get it in the bonus episode. And for completing the game, we get presents from Isun based on how well we did. We got Karmic Transformer 1, 2, Karmic Returner, Stray Bead number 100, the String of Beads. For completing all 100 Stray Beads, we got Karmic Transformer 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 
And finally, nine. We got all the bonuses. And now, they allow us to make a save to begin New Game Plus. I'll be seeing everyone next time, where we check that out, and check out a few other things we missed throughout our playthrough, throughout our journey. Have a wonderful rest of your day.